This is a diagnosis I really like. You can see in this case, the patient is a young woman who'd had a prior C-section and had been having cyclical abdominal wall pain ever since. Now, if you look at the CT and the MR at the site of the patient's symptoms, there's actually an irregularly shaped speculated mass. It's showing moderate enhancement on the CT, it's T1 dark, it's T2 bright, and it's showing avid enhancement on MR. This is a classic example for abdominal wall endometriosis. Now, it's important to remember that endometriosis uh, in the abdominal wall will not necessarily have the same signal characteristics as what you're going to see in the pelvis. In the pelvis, these lesions are often going to be T1 bright and often will show T2 shading. That is actually not the case when you talk about the abdominal wall because much of what you're seeing is actually desmoplastic reaction and fibrosis induced by the lesion itself. So usually these lesions look solid. They're T1 dark, T2 bright unless you have some hemorrhage, which can alter the signal characteristics, and they're often going to show moderate to marked enhancement.